Whoop, whoop, whoop. I don't like traveling. What in the world happened to my game? I've never seen anything like that. That's entirely. Is it because I minimized it? Because it looked fine before that. Let's try it again, I guess. All right, then. I had to move my mic a bunch because the cat's all up in my grill. All right, that is yeah. fixed. That was awkward. I think you should stay on point. Your instincts seem to be right on target. Huh, I wonder what I did with Nick Valentine. I gotta be honest with you. I huh? feel more comfortable. Yeah, right. I'm I'm just 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 Weirdly dark over here. Wanna chat for a bit? Got work to do. Can't talk now. Huh? Hi, how are you? Yeah. Can't remember My God. the last time when I had clean fingernails. What a colorful cast of characters. Like, I have a computer. I know I have a computer somewhere. He's alone at Covenant. Okay. Weird. I should have uh, looked at where Covenant was, eh? There you go, it's right there. It's all up in there. Welcome to Covenant. These guys have been here a long time. Why are you guys here? Oh, he's got that jitter leg. Look, he's got that jitter leg. He can't control it. Oh, thanks for the shop key, idiot. 
I don't know. If they don't want to disappear, then I'm going to just, you know, hide them. The Jimmy Legs. Oh, Piper's my sidekick. I see, I see. Let's head out. Well, all right. So, any stories you two come across out there? I get the exclusive, right? Piper, I wouldn't know who else to tell. Oh, wow. Back off the camera, Nick. I've been told the Valentine... You know, I've been thinking about how things went down with Winter. I never properly thanked you for that. Now all we have to worry about is Zombie Eddie coming to seek revenge. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that was Zombie Eddie we took care of back there. But regardless of form, Winter was it. The only reminder left of the original Nick Valentine. The last proof outside of some long-lost Institute archive I was ever just a mechanical copy of some cop from a bygone era. I'm not sure how to feel. Does it really matter? Winter, Jenny, Valentine, they're gone. We're here. We get to make the world what we want. Oh, you're right. It just took me until now to realize it. Because I was Nick Valentine. I had his memories, his, his fears, all that poor bastard's hope. And I remember getting the call to head to some lab in Cambridge to get that neurotrans whatever. And the next thing I know, I'm in a trash heap. My family, my home, my entire life, gone. Then I discover all those things that they weren't even mine. Everything I ever was belonged to Nick. I'd hoped with winter gone, the last hint of that old world snuffed out, I could, I could finally be free. But being out here with you, what I, what I finally realized after all this time was that taking down winter, it wasn't about Nick or Jenny or even you or me. It was about justice about doing what's right, and that act of goodness, that's ours. All the good we've done, that's ours, and ours alone. And even if that's the only thing in this world that I can ever claim as mine, not Nick's, not the Institute's, but mine, then I can die happy. And none of it would have ever happened if it weren't for you. I'm not sure I'll ever be able to thank you for that. You don't have to, Nick. We're friends. This is what friends do. <laughs> you can't stop being noble now, can you? Well, come on then. We're not helping anyone standing around here. the plan looking for something let's see if I have anything else you could have you could coincidentally wear wow not even accessories eh not even accessories greetings Welcome. 
I haven't played Fallout in 5 ever. But the show comes out soon. And I have no incentive or desire to like... I got nothing else. To play. So I... Come to my familiar. How goes on your end? How goes? How goes? Can you wear this? I know that he could wear... Oh no. A couple similar trench coats. And I'm wondering if any of my mods... Count as that. The same clothing type. Here, take this overcoat. Will you wear it? No? Give it back. I am gonna leave your ass here, Nick... Nicholas... Valentino. I swear to Jeebus. It's like one of those old 2D flash games on Newgrounds dial-up. It's like, oh, dress up Nick Valentine. So kawaii. He could be schoolgirl. He could be maid. Can you wear this, you slut? Yeah, you can. You could wear that fucking scientist outfit. Oh, no. Now he's stuck in that because he didn't have any... Because I don't, I don't get his jacket at all. Oh, yes. That's so fucking weird. Okay. That's my Nick Valentine, I guess. Can you wear the medic coat? No? Okay. <laughs> this is unexpected and weird, and it looks like he's about to go solve a case at a gym. He's a robot in a cheesy 80s sitcom, and he's trying to blend in to get a lead on a case, so he's still wearing his stupid robo-fedora. You know... Can you wear any of these pride outfits? No? Give it back. The fedora here? It's 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 the cheesy eighties comedy bit. Ho ho ho, he doesn't fit in. I wanna dress him like a slut. I don't have anything that he could wear though that will just make him such a body thoughty. Alright. That's that's freakish. Let's go man. Let's go. Oh no, the dog was standing over Jacob Orden here, like the hound at the end of Fox and the Hound. He didn't want me to do it to his best friend. I have no idea why I'm going to the one hour Photoshop at all. What is going on here? Oh no, that really sucks. I mean, it's good that you're there, but the situa situation sucks, so... It borked, um... Any clue as to what it could be? Any, like, is, does... He's trying to get it to start, like... Is he replacing the part that he knows what it is, or is he still in that, you know, uh, troubleshooting stage? Terminal's got this locked. Nick, you you are rocking it, my guy. I gotta take a photo of that back. Hey, Nick. You need? Nick, I'm gonna take a screenshot of you. You look good, my dude. You've been robo working out.
please read notes on using the dark room. Oh no. I'm probably not gonna eliminate harmful light sources in the dark room. Okay. Developer stop bath. Don't you have to do this in a specific time limit or is that a different game I'm thinking of where I was messing around in a dark room? And you have to put the photos in for a very specific amount of time. How do I eliminate this source of light? Actually, I think I'm just going to leave. I don't care about the dark room. I, I don't have infinite time to play, so I'm just going to go on a different quest that intrigues me. I don't know why I'm talking to Newlin, Newton Oberly. Oh, that's them? No, 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 no. I literally only got you, my guy, so we could go over to the Island to Is Isla Nublar. What the? Who's causing trouble? Who's causing a ruckus over here? Oh wow, a lot of people are causing a ruckus. That's weird. I mean, make his ass install the right thing. Uh, uh, uh. Uh. There's a pretty wild mod out there that adds so much wildlife to the game. It makes it feel very vaguely JP -y. Jurassic Parky. A harness? Ooh, you kinky rust devil. What were you into, my man? Oh, it's all the way up there. I got you, fam. Let me go to the coastal cottage. Dinosaurs plus anything equals good. Uh, dinosaurs plus tourists, good. Where I go? Boop, 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 boop. Nick, did I lose you? I lost him. He's gone. He'll find me. He'll find me. He always does. He's he's a synth. He's got GPS, probably. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't like, don't like. How do I get to the 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 residence? This is not a staircase like in Skyrim, my bad. Whoa, whoa. Leave my puppy alone. Hey, there's one that's just living on that island out there.
There's one just deading on that island over there. Oh, snap. Oh, there's their house. It's spooky over here. I want it to be daytime. I'm just having a mighty spook right now. It's all up in my bones, my chilly, chilly bones. Poor man died doing what he loved. Jerking it. Where I would like like a bed or a chair so it's the time. Damn it! Come in! I know you're listening on the other end. Where is she? Where is my daughter? Can you please? Wow, you sound salty, man. You okay? You sound saltier than this water. Yeah, I'm gonna go look at some junk. Dear Kasumi, please don't rob Hawk. Uh-oh, she didn't get this in time. If you ever get locked out of the safe, then the answer is here in the boathouse. Picture where the key is. Love, granddad. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. For final hollow tape, I could sell this for millions. I never really thought about who or what I am, but God, where do I start? The radio. I was right about the range. I managed to get a signal, a strong signal from up north. There's a group. Oh man, I was just looking for a key, and I accidentally oh. unlocked her whole ass mystery and tragic backstory. My bad. Oh man, did she get lured into a cult? I can make my way to them from there. Jam, jelly, jam, jelly. All right, let's put away my lightsaber, and that is and is not a euphemism. And then I will wait until the foggy morning of the am. Let me all up in there. Take me home tonight. I slept on your porch in a lawn chair. All right. I think that kept the rhythm pretty well. You don't mind. We let ourselves in. Nick, yeah, you didn't have a door. You need to get to the apocalypse. She could be hurt. You should nail up like a board or something. Uh, Kenji, was it? Why did you go over the details with me and my partner here? You have to get to work right away. Wait, you're my partner. Do you not? Has this not been okay? We'll get we'll get back to that. We'll come back around to that. Oh, there I could sarcastic it. 
So, what's the story with you and Nick? Nick didn't tell you? Ran with him on one of his cases a few years back, searching for some sort of lost heirloom. He needed a boat. Things didn't end well. We were double-crossed by the client once we had what he was looking for. I still have some lead lodged into my hip. Ah, uh, right. Yeah, it's starting to come back. Nick has lead lodged Sorry. into his everywhere. So but for fun, not for business. That's all that mattered. And now you can return the favor by finding my daughter. I like that rather than find a new shirt, the guy that I'm talking to patched it in four places completely symmetrically. Usually a shirt would wear out at the elbows. Yep, that's me. Lowly partner. Like, what are the odds that it wore out in four spots perfectly the same? Getting back to my daughter. It all started on the biceps and the forearms. Our daughter Kasumi likes to fix things. It's just a very weird patch job he has going on over there. Like, at some point you just give up, man. There are more, way more shirts for free. I'll, I'll drop a bunch in your room. My daughter is 19. She knows how to survive and she's capable. I... I think maybe she left because she wanted her own life. No. Oh she my god. She told us where she was going. She would have said something. Guys. I is in danger. Okay, she has to be missing for 48 hours before you could file a police report, okay? Uh, I mean, this is the apocalypse, so it's not a law. I just mean with Nick and I here. We're gonna go hang out. Oh, yeah, let's extort them. Let's talk money. Investigations for the missing aren't cheap. Uh, sorry about this, Kenji. Expenses and all that. Of course. How does 350 cap sound? If she went far, that means travel expenses. We could make it 400. I know your daughter is missing, but caps? Don't hold out on me. You want to find your daughter, right? 500 caps. That's all we have. I already took a look around. I th think I know what happened to Kasumi. You did? What did you find? Where is she? What a fun costume. I need to ask you an important question. What kind of question is that? Mm -hmm. Your daughter made contact with a group of synths. She thinks she's one of them. What? That's... that's crazy. She's not a synth. She's our daughter. We raised her. I... I gave birth to her. She's flesh and blood, not a synthetic. That's how synths work, Mrs. Nakano. They replace people. This could have happened recently. I know my own daughter. She's not a synth. This is what I was afraid I cut her open of. every Someone day to check. My daughter's mind. And I look at all of her meat. Went, all of her meat parts. I think I know where Kasumi went. A place I am playing home. with uh, my cat on my lap. Door? My God, goofy God, ginger God, cat has been laying on my lap pretty much since I started the stream. Take my other I got my legs outside. kicked up on the desk. It has Controller a in hand. And it is built for distance. A magic boat ride? Will there be sea monsters? Uh, while I know the seas aren't exactly safe, I am confident the boat can get you there before you go. Here's the payment we discussed. I'll have something more when Kasumi is safely back home. I know my partner here can be a little glib, but we won't rest until we get to the bottom of this. You two have my word. Find Kasumi. Please.
Yeah, why the hell would I tell the Brotherhood about this? That's crazy. I'm gonna steal your cola! Is there any hints I can get from you? Mrs. Nakano, my daughter is, is strong human. enough to make She's the trip. Not a sin. Excuse That's what they all say. Take my boat. Find my daughter. Please. All right. It's time to do the distant oh there's a cat in here that I can kill oh I'll be back for you kitty you just wait I'll be back I wish I was killing something on this boat so I could have an action shot. If I jump off, will I, the boat make it to Far Harbor without me? It's a ghost boat. Oh no, Far Harbor is spooky. But there's still a red rocket here. Curiouser and curiouser. Mainlander. Are you lost? This is Far Harbor. We, uh, we don't get many visitors around Weapons here. Weapons are what's gonna win us back our island. We don't need no freeloaders or more help, Mainlander. So you can get back in your boat and leave. Alan, this isn't your dock. It belongs to the whole town. Your hickory dickory dock? S strangers are welcome. Uh, sorry, you've caught us during a... A difficult time. We're retarring our yeah, roof and we're really point. bad at Not it. All visitors have good intentions. So, uh, what's your business here? What business do a man, a dwarf, and an elf have in the Far Harbor Mark? That always sounded like the beginning of a joke in Two Towers. What business do a man, a dwarf, and an elf have in the Ritter Mark? So, you were saying? I need information about a synth refuge on this island. Ah, another Commonwealth traveler looking for Acadia, then. Excuse me, no, I don't want to take a picture of the old lady. Get her out of my view. Ugh, elderly. Damn it. Mariners ain't coming. Something's coming through the fog. You help us defend What inconvenient town. time. I was literally about to slip into Avery's DMs. Okay, well, I guess I'll get out of here. Yeah, I'll go help you guys. Let's go. Oh, yeah, I'm already up here. You do. Man the fall. Something's out there. What's out there, guys? You gotta be honest with me. What the hell? I peeled everyone. Oh, I have a cannon. This is the funniest shit. Using this weird cannon thing. 
Oh, you gotta, you gotta help this guy out. I'm not very lit up there. No, why do I want to target them? I'm targeting these things down there. No, eyes on the fog. What not only whipped a grenade up here? Standing at all, if it weren't for you. They call me the Mariner, shipwright, handyman, and the only one keeping the harbor afloat. Well, beside Captain Avery. Town's lucky you're here. You blowing smoke up my sails. <laughs> I'm trying to get in the Mariner's fish bucket. There is. I don't suppose you'd be willing to lend a hand. In order to do proper repairs, I need tools. Specialized tools, and they won't be easy to come by. 450 caps if you can, though. So, I'd be risking my life for only 450 caps? <laughs> I'm a bit short on caps, but I have old Jimmy's shotgun. Perhaps you can that play in some other way. Sign me up. I'll help. Eagle's Cove Tannery. Tools are certain to be there. Now get. Ooh, yes. Tell me to get it like that again. Quick, like a bunny. Meet Captain Avery, like, yeah, with a cleaver. Oh, are you guys, uh... You see what we're up against. The fog and the creatures it spits out have taken the whole island from my people. But for your help when we needed it, you deserve this. Whoopee. If you manage to survive despite all that, you must be tough. <laughs> Ornery, more like. I just... I'm done cowering behind your damn hull, Avery. Time you let me deal with the real problem. With the right people and my guns, I can end those children of Adam cultists for good. The fog's been here forever. The children didn't make it. Before the rat eaters came, the fog was under control. They come, and it all goes wrong. It's time we do something. No need to burden a stranger with all this nonsense. What's the deal with the Children of Adam? They're religious folk. They worship the power of Adam. Which is uh, radiation, I guess. If you want details, you'd have to find and ask them. We used to have a peace with them until a certain hothead menace named Alan Lee... Now that's enough. That preacher came into the harbor saying that it was Adam's will that we lost our land. That it was Adam's goddamn will that we lost so many friends and family. And that the Adam would wipe this whole place clean of us. If it were up to me, you'd hang for what you did to that preacher, Alan. 
God dang. I could hang him right now with my bullets. Have the children made the fog worse? Absolutely not. There's not one bit of evidence. Geiger counters don't lie, Avery. The fog's gotten more lethal year over year. And now the fog's covering the whole island. But only after the children came. You know as well as I do, that's happened before. Sure, people have theories the children are involved, but no one, and I mean no one, has proof. What did he do to the preacher? Alan pulled the gun on the preacher, the preacher, the, leecher, his. the midnight reacher, any law, just custom and popular sentiment. And after everything the preacher said, it was abundantly clear doing anything to Alan would have made matters worse. Can we get back to business? To defeat the Huns. You're headed for Acadia, right? Getting there will Did be dangerous. they send me Meet daughters? Old Longfellow. No one knows the fog like him. But a uh, word of warning, he's a bit of an acquired taste. Like pear. What's Old Longfellow's story? He's the best hunter on the island. Fearless. <laughs> Some say crazy. If someone needs to get to Acadia, he's the only one that'll do it. But uh, people around here are known for being stubborn, willful, and other less flattering things. But Longfellow's got a reputation even among us. Well, I do have... What can you tell me about a king? Ask Longfellow. Thanks for the info. Bet, please. Lend a hand. Mm -hmm. And let me say something you might not hear. Mm -hmm. Protect your loved ones with my fine hand cannons. Huh. <laughs> the mainlander. Great. Fire your gun a few times and you think you're some sort of hero? This is our fight, our island, not yours. Hey, buddy. I was just trying to help. Charity makes you weak, makes you need it more and more, until you're starving from the lack of it. What happens next time when you wait here, huh? Either us harbormen survive on our own. So if you're here to buy some ordnance, do you? I'll take a look. You got it. He's, uh, essential. Wow, no one cared.
Not for nothing, but why does that guy have a minigun? I'm shocked. Shocked, I say. Just a dude. <laughs> 